Uh, from watching documentaries, because I watch a lot of documentaries on, you know, I guess, street gangs in different parts of the States. Mm -hmm. And I remember um, there was definitely a time where I noticed Detroit was kind of the one that was coming up a lot as one of the roughest places in the States. Mm -hmm. And I think now, you know, you'd find uh, Chicago is the one that gets talked about a lot. Yeah. Um, I mean, as someone who grew up in Detroit, I mean, can you sort of talk about, first of all, I know that you've got the miles and certain miles are rougher than than the others. Right, you're east side, west side. I mean, it's a lot of areas. Uh, I grew up in Southfield, which borders Detroit on the north side. So I didn't grow up in the city limits, you know what I mean? But when you talk to somebody, like, don't nobody know what the fuck Southfield is. Mm -hmm. You know, just like there's some shit outside of here. You say it's Adelaide because it's right next door. Um, yeah, so I started going to the city when I was, you know, my mom worked for a doctor in the city. So, like, every weekend I would go and help her at the doctor's office and shit. The doctor would give me, like, way too much money. Used to be like taking blood down to the lab and shit. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, I'm a good number. Can I go to work with you again next weekend, ma? This motherfucker for giving me like matchbox cars, all kinds of toys and shit. It was fucking incredible. <laughs> but when I came of age, you know what I mean? When I got to high school, and got a little bit more mobile. I was in the city, man. You know what I mean? I was in the city. That's, 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 ain't shit going on outside the city. Mm. You know what I mean? But yeah, the east side, east side's rough, west side's rough. There's pockets, pockets of wild shit everywhere. You know what I mean? I got carjacked, all kinds of shit. Oh, you got carjacked? Hell yeah. What? Best thing that ever happened to me in my life, probably. And why would you say that? Because I've been aware of everything in my immediate shit ever since. Mm -hmm. You ain't gonna catch me slipping after that. You know what I mean? That motherfucker took me for a ride. I had the homies' records in the trunk. I'm like, man, you can have this car. I don't give a fuck. Just let me get my homies' records. Like my my OG, my muse, one of my teachers on this DJ shit. Hey, man. He's like, man, what comes to 10? I'm going to fucking shoot you. I'm like, so you ain't going to let me get the records, huh? <laughs> fuck. Yeah, that was a bummer. Was this a, like, at a, like a traffic lot? That was at a gas station on 7 Mile and I-75. 75 and the, uh, 75 is the freeway going downtown. We stopped to get some gas real quick. I was going to meet my man Dez over at Aunt Fiddler's studio, actually. About 11.30 on Mother's Day, 1994. Yeah, that shit was crazy. Well, as you were getting out the car. Well, the funny thing is I was playing a JDB tape, right? <laughs> and this dude walks up to me like, man, that sounds good. What's that? I was like, man, that's my man JD. He's like, man, shut the fuck up and move over. You know what I mean? That shit was crazy. Jay got me in trouble that night, I guess, if you think about it. <laughs> Jay, you got me carjacked, man. Wow. I thought this dude was genuinely excited about your music. He just wanted to take my shit. <laughs> and I mean, other I, I guess other than that, you know, is there other shit that you've sort of seen that was pretty, you know, you know, like some pretty straight shit that you probably wouldn't necessarily see maybe in places here like Adelaide? Yeah, I mean, you know, Man, tempers. People got short, quick, very quick tempers, very quick fuses. So some shit can go from this to that real quick. You know what I mean? People shooting in the club. You know what I mean? That was well, you, my that was you, my fault though. I broke a Tupac record. Detroit is Tupac Central. I used to do this shit at St Andrews when when the record started getting whack, like something like a phenomenon. Hello, Cool, cool J, J, and fucking like, I hate it if I rule the world by Nas and Lord. I hate that fucking song. Like, how you go from Illmatic to that? Even old to this day, you don't like that joint. I fucking hate that shit, man. For real? It's cool, but you make it the third single. Don't make it the first single. You know what I mean? Don't go from Illmatic to like hit records. Let it breathe for a minute. You know what I mean? So I would play some shit that I ain't like for a minute, and then I would take the needle, drag it across it, break the shit on the ground, and play what I want. I did that shit with Tupac one night. I broke, uh, hit him up, and I played Unbelievable. And it was like fucking 600 people punching each other in the face. And then the next week was the get back, like the retaliation. There was an off-duty Border Patrol officer at the back of the club. 
Cats got to fighting at prime time. He got spooked, went to pull his shit out, shot himself in the leg. Oh. Stampede. You know what I mean? We didn't know he shot, we didn't know it was just somebody that fucking shot himself in the leg. You think somebody's just fucking yeah. letting off in the club. So <sighs> that shit was crazy. I did that. <laughs> I take pride in that shit. <laughs> It's this one crazy. motherfucker that still to this day is like, man, shoot, you owe me seven hundred dollars for that ring I lost that night. Like, man, whatever, motherfucker. <laughs> so is that, I, I imagine the gun culture in Detroit is pretty strong. Yeah, it's just sort it's of, America. I mean, it's any. There's no exceptions. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? But I mean, like in New York, I understand. To my understanding, like the gun laws are much stricter. Yeah, laws don't mm-hmm. mean shit though, because the guns are still there. You know what I mean? Yeah. Cats ain't scared of laws. They're scared of guns. <laughs> you know what true. I mean? Yeah, true that. The, the, the last thing. Oh, yeah.